Let's get down to it. Everybody, 6.15, Wednesday morning, and uh, we get dry conditions in Grand Rapids, but uh, there are some rain and snow showers down to the south near I-94, and uh, it's possible there could be a light, uh, grassy accumulation of sorts here as we go along this morning. I uh, don't have any ground truth as to uh, what exactly is happening along I-94 at this point, but just judging off the radar and uh, using some common sense here, it does uh, appear as though there's probably some wet snowflakes uh, around and maybe mixing with rain around Kalamazoo, uh, soon to be Battle Creek. This is not a heavy snow event, but uh, probably some flakes mixing in there where it looks like it can come down decently for a, um, a certain stretch here over the next couple hours. Temperatures, though, are several degrees above the freezing mark, so much of this just melting on contact. Mostly cloudy skies, though, in Grand Rapids. I don't think we're going to see any moisture locally in GR. It's all centered down to the south. And then partly sunny skies will begin to materialize as we go through the late morning and afternoon, oscillating between partly and mostly cloudy and a high temperature that gets to around 40 degrees or so by day's end. That was our high, by the way, on Tuesday. So kind of holding steady today. We'll jump up several tomorrow, then go colder on Friday. Friday, but uh, market warming over the weekend. And as I was talking about yesterday, just a near perfect weekend conditions. A third straight weekend here around West Michigan where we can't complain. A good amount of sunshine temperatures that will be rocketing upward by Sunday afternoon and could could take a shot at 60 at that point in time. This is the weather map for Sunday afternoon at 2 o'clock. We're going to have brisk southwesterly flow coming in here. Just these high level clouds passing on by and a very similar turnout to what we've had the last couple of Sundays where we've gotten our best warming uh, there on the back half of the weekend. Right now, 35 in Grand Rapids, 33 Ionia. The zone where we're tracking those rain and snow showers, you can see the surface temperatures are several degrees above the freezing mark, though where it does come down, some of that snow, uh, the temps probably will come down briefly locally. So again, can't rule out some grassy uh, accumulations for our southernmost sections between now and say 10, 11 o'clock. Feels like temperatures running in the 20s to around 30 degrees. A little bigger scope at the radar shows that the back edge is over northern Illinois. That'll take several hours to completely clear out of our region. This is just kind of a baby system, though. It doesn't have a whole lot with it, and it'll be clearing out of here. Another weak piece of energy dropping southward out of Alberta into Montana, and that'll be the next system to come in here for tomorrow afternoon. Watch these snow showers and mixed rain showers exiting uh, by around noontime. Then we're left with a mixture of sun and clouds, it does appear. You go overnight tonight, partly cloudy skies will lead into tomorrow, but clouds will be on the increase once again on Thursday, and that next week system will come in with some broken precip, sort of like it did yesterday afternoon. Did you notice some of those snowflakes mixing in in Grand Rapids, but really not accumulating with the temps uh, well above the freezing marks? Same deal for tomorrow, uh, say mid-afternoon and beyond. You go colder on Friday, but look at this jump up. About 10 degrees or so for Saturday. Tack on another 10 on Sunday. We could be near 60 by Sunday afternoon.